Arnon Shimshoni was born in 1935 in Tel Aviv. Back then, Israel was not yet declared a state, and there was a British mandate in charge of both Jews and Arabs in Israel. Living in Israel at that time was both filled with war, but also filled with an important purpose, to help build a new Jewish country. This was mostly pursued by the youth movements that sent groups of teenagers to help at the kibbutz. The ideal of the youth movement was to, to become farmers, because uh, the theory of the socialist Zionism was not only returning to the homeland, also a revolution in the um, structure of the Jewish society. To become farmers, to tilt the land, to grow vegetables, etc., etc., and not to become intellectuals or, uh, or uh, free professions. This was the idea, the ideal at the time. At the age of 87, Arnon looks back at his life and at the 74-year-old state of Israel, thinking of what his dreams about Israel were back then. We were part of a big thing, yes, I think so, yes, I agree with that. We had a purpose, and uh, this feeling is uh, not simple anymore, uh, because uh, Israel, as it has developed, uh, is on the one hand exceptional, uh, becoming a country which we never believed would become, regarding its uh, size, size of population, and, uh, and economic uh, in, uh, situation. But he also reflects about those dreams and the spirit of the time. Look, I think that our dream in the past was uh, a fantasy, an ideal, yes, uh, I mean, you know, uh, yeah, a kind of a paradise. They desired for democracy and equality, and Israel becoming more and more capitalistic was not what he aspired. I hope that we still have a way back uh, to, to, to better or, uh, or more equality and more... Uh, uh, understanding to the other side, but uh, the other side, I mean the Palestinians. But uh, to say that uh, uh, the, the, the country, the land, the state of Israel at present was our uh, desired uh, goal uh, will not be accurate. I think we have much to repair. To his belief, the definition of Zionism has changed. We don't aspire every Jew to come to Israel, but Zionism is still a big part of Israel's existence. I still think that there is no other solution for the existence of the Jewish people. Uh, you can see what is happening now even in some countries. Anti-Semitism, is something which is very difficult to, not only to accept, but to understand. But uh, it is really something which uh, <clears throat> will not disappear. Being part of the founding and building of a country is a pretty unique experience nowadays. But like always, with big expectations, also come disappointments. The good thing is that Israel is only 74 years old. And with learning both from the past and the present, we can aspire to an even better future. <laughs>